Hello, NVIDIA creators. My name is James Trelly, and I'm a producer and animator at NASA Goddard Space Flight Center. Over the past couple months, I've had the pleasure of working side by side with the NVIDIA creators team to make a couple of really fun tutorials in Blender. I talked a lot about different techniques that I use on a daily basis. For a lot of the renders I do both for my work at NASA and also for a lot of the freelance projects that I do for people in the commercial industries, uh, musicians, concert visualizers, album artwork, and all kinds of other really fun projects. I do a lot of my work in Blender and I shared a lot of my really cool secrets to optimize my workflow and specifically add-ons that I use on a daily basis as well. So I definitely encourage you to check out those tutorials. I also wanted to talk about how I use NVIDIA products on a daily basis in my workflow. I do use an NVIDIA Quadro RTX 5000 GPU for my renders. It's a beast of a machine and really, really, really speeds up my workflow so much. Uh, for quite a few years, actually, before I, I switched over to building my own rig and then using actually a laptop that NVIDIA sent me, a really awesome piece of, of uh, technology as well, I'd been using an old gaming laptop and it was really uh, just a quantum leap for me almost when I moved to using the new setup here with the Quadro RTX 5000. Uh, my renders were going from hours long to minutes and seconds long. And even just working in the viewport, it's been so much more responsive for me going through and actually creating my renders in Blender itself. There's the new Optics Denoiser that's coming pre-packaged with all the latest releases of Blender. I use that religiously in a lot of the work I do in, in the viewport. And just being able to see my render and not fight through so much noise is really, really crucial for me as an artist, actually, to be able to iterate so much faster as I'm working through with my designs. When I actually get to the render process itself, and especially when I'm rendering very large pieces like animations or really, really intensive scenes with a lot of volume data inside them, in something like Redshift, which very intensively uses my GPU, awesome to have that Quadro RTX on my side, fighting the good fight and really speeding up my renders and giving me awesome results in a fraction of the time that I had before. It's been a really awesome time working with NVIDIA through the past couple months on this tutorial series. I wanted to sincerely thank them for bringing me on and, and shedding some light onto the Blender community. It's a really awesome com community of people and I'm always so excited to see the incredible support and new developments that are coming to the software. And so much of that integrates so well with NVIDIA's products that they're putting out uh, every single day here. So thank you so much again and I will see you on the next one. Stay tuned.